Here is my funny toad purse from the Renaissance Festival. We had a long weekend, so I thought I would put on some nails and show you a little bit of what I was obsessed with last year, figuring out how to do nails. There is a dust collector and um, the machine that the grinder, like what is that called, a nail drill. It's amazing and the dust collector is a must have. So I just go ahead and take off the gel polish, um, the old gel polish with the nail drill. Just be super careful. It's um, a really kind of basic beginner set. And then here I am just buffing the uh, fake plastic nails. And then I got these little posts that go on with the tacky glue. It's like the old fashioned teacher uh, glue where they would you know, put posters on the wall. So it's a sticky tack, that's what it's called. So it just sticks them to the little posts. And the nice thing is it, you just use um, the rubbing alcohol. So it, there's not a lot of odor with this uh, equipment, which I really like. I tried doing like the acrylic nails um, at home and the smell was just, I couldn't take it. So this is really nice, the gel polish and just rubbing alcohol. So here I am just putting on the uh, nail primer and the base coat and then you just cure it under the little light. I know this is a little different from my regular videos, um, but I was absolutely obsessed. I kind of stopped making videos last year, um, my felting videos, and just became obsessed with learning how to do my nails. Um, I have my hands in water for dog grooming all day long, so I can't really wear like regular polish. So having the gel was like game changer for me. Obviously these nails are too long, so I did have to take them off for work. Um, but, and then the only other problem that I had is when you paint the clear fake nails, um, the light has a really hard time curing through the dark colors. So you'll just want to use glue. I did try to use, um, gel adhesive and then curing it and they just would not stay on. So I ended up just having to glue them on. So I would not recommend doing that or you can use the gel adhesive uh, and cure it before you paint them. Um, but it was easier for me to paint them, you know, not using my left hand. So it was easier painting them. Um, so here they are, I did the Hocus Pocus nails and they turned out really cute, I thought. Some of the gel polish was a little bit thick. So really make sure and cure them all the way through. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Um, I'm not doing nail videos, don't worry. It just was a fun thing to do for, and I, it went along with the dolls because they were hocus pocus. So it's not gonna be a nail channel, but thanks for watching and I hope you just enjoyed seeing um, the nails. All right, see you next time guys, thanks.